Greetings, Keishlings. Keishlings, I'm here with my live reaction of One Punch Man, Chapter 126. Sorry for the delay, I had some errands to do and whatnot, but, uh, yeah. Let's see here. Psychos. Okay. We got Fabuki and Tatsumaki on the cover here. Take a step forward. It's my turn to shine. That it is, Fabuki. That it is. I mean, she is, uh... She's really amped up her psychic powers. I can only imagine what she'll be capable of in the future. But, uh, let's see here. Oh, we're, we're still on the minecart tracks. Okay, there's like a full-on mining operation down there. What are those things? Are those robots or, or monsters? I can't tell. Um, but yeah. Oh, what is this place? Those are monsters. Okay, I scrolled down and I could see them clear wait they have like eyes in their like mouths they're like four-legged spider-esque things with like a shell on them. huh okay what are they mining for though uh what is this place oh they're mining out freaking rubies and gold they've they're like oh you see this little piece of gold i'm gonna take it no one will know no one will know it's like wait who are those people in that minecart? Crap! People know! <laughs> Underground gold veins and ruby veins. Rubies are there too. Flashy. I see. So this is the source of funds for your evil deeds. Eh, well, source of funds. Saitama wants to steal all the valuables. Well, they're putting a spotlight on them, it looks like. It's like, oh, red alert, red alert. Oh god, all of the giant things are like now <laughs> looking in their direction yay whoa okay now they're just gonna ching, ching. yeek <laughs> i'm on i'm on your side he's hiding behind side thomas <laughs> okay. you know it don't survive long when it's side thomas right hey stop yanking my cake oh god they're both about to pierce at the same time and oh okay it looks like Saitama detached his cape him and flashy are jumping up into the air ready to strike and yeah the yeah as you figured the monsters are dead you know a lot of gore viscera also it's just interesting to see how they fight right side by side you know saitama's just pop boom and it just explodes and then you got flashy zip 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 with this like weird curve slash it looks like he's doing or maybe he's just moving around and hitting at different points. That's probably it. <clears throat> and then he's going for a, a second one for him. Okay, well, yeah, they're, they're no problem. And the little monster, who I'm going to just start calling Mike Wazowski because he kind of is. Um, he's just in the cart and he's like, his eye is bulging out of his head. Eee! <laughs> or eh? <laughs> Yep, and they're back in the cart now, and the monster parts are just falling to the ground, and Flashy now realizes he's looking at Saitama like he isn't a lie. He isn't a fraud. He's not a, a big fat phony like I thought. <laughs> hey, not bad, Saitama. <laughs> You're kind of fast. Kind of, huh? And the monster's like, who the hell are these guys? <laughs> oh, that's exactly what he's... <laughs> They're too strong. Hey. Y yes? Cape. Eh? Oh, he was holding it and he was like, I'm hiding behind the cape over here. Take it, take it. <laughs> take it, don't break it. Okay, cape's back on. All right, then. And really one of the monsters survived or is that a new one which why did it think it would get it speared his cape though that's not going to he's being separated from the group <laughs> also it looks like it came out of a different tunnel so it might have not been one that was cut down prior probably not because they've traveled a little ways um hey and oh flashy's like hey wait <laughs> Uh, oh god there's more coming out of tunnel adjacent to the the track this is bad i guess really not but it looks bad but given who we're dealing with here Bwah! oh god the tracks the tracks out the the track 
Yeah, I, who would have destroyed it though? Like that's so precision. Unless maybe this is somewhere around where Orochi was coming out of the ground, and he probably would have wrecked it. But it's really hard to say some of this infrastructure, so and the layout of things. So yeah. But anyway, so that's uh. Damn it! Long live the monster association. Oh, he's going to just. He's like. <laughs> Suicide attack! Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna die anyway, I'll take you with me! He's <laughs> grabbing Flash by the leg. Oh god, there's a lot of them coming out of that tunnel. How did they even fit? I mean, they were massive. And he's still holding on to Flashy as Flashy zips out and it's like, I'm gonna. These little fucks. Oh, he just. Oh, wait, he's whirling around them, so yeah, they're, it's gonna be one of those, like the. It's like. You, it attacks so fast that they don't even know they're being hit and then as soon as they sheath the sword and then it's like it's like what happened i'm fine and then all of a sudden it's like two 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 pieces of their body just start falling off yeah that's what it kind of looks like as flashy's now clinging to the wall and saitama came through and it's like out of my way bitches uh, and he's got a bag of gold in his teeth is that in his teeth? I can't really tell. He stole stuff. I, I, hmm. Well, he de does deserve a lot of back compensation for all the things he's saved the world from. I don't think he needs to resort to stealing, even from monsters, but Saitama, who could stop him? D the dang me. But yeah, so he just came back. Oh, it was in his teeth. Okay. Flashy looks happy to see him. I, I think their little time in the mine card is like, I've made a friend who's pretty powerful himself. But, uh, so he's either starting to respect, respect Saitama or he's just starting to realize Saitama isn't what he thought he was, at the very least. And little Mikey's still hanging on to Flashy. As the minecart now r rides off the track, which that just shows how fast they are. Because that was not a long stretch of track, and here he is. Like, they both caught up with it while it was still going. So, yeah. <clears throat> Let's see here. Huh? Oh, so Tama dropped the gold to save Mike. <laughs> we need directions, so don't you fall. And there goes his gold, and he's realizing he's... He's like the scream painting. Or like Kevin. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway. So, oh, it actually made it to the other side of the track, so that's nice. You know, Saitama could probably just jump off the bounce off the wall and stuff and, like, just wall jump his way like Mario to get the gold back. Um, and probably catch up pretty quick. But anyway, they're all back in the cart now. Hmm. You're pretty damn good. What's wrong? Nothing. <laughs> he's he's miffed about the gold that he stole. Um, ah, just going Don't do that to Mikey. He hasn't done anything to you yet. He's thought horrible things, but he hasn't done anything particularly wrong. Um, no sleeping. You better give us good directions. He's not sleeping, Saitama. He fucking fainted from today's experiences. Um, eh, uh, sure, sure thing. Oh, <laughs> hello, Garo Garo, uh, or Giro Giro. I always get the names mixed up, sorry about that. Um, but she got them squashed titters, um, up on the couch. Somehow she turned over, so she is presenting the bottom. Um, gasp, gasp, mm -hmm. uh, Rover, my telepathy is getting no response. Also, what is this? Is Baldy, is, is he a hero too? Oh, there's the picture of when they went down the roller coaster. I say roller coaster, you know what I mean. It was like a roller coaster drop off, you know, like Splash Mountain or something. Um, is that what it is in Walt Disney World? Whatever, anyway. But uh, even a weirdo like this is closing in on the Inner Sanctum. Tatsumaki, too. I guess I'll have to deal with her myself. Oh, so she's like, I've got a fart. Well, she got a... What is that? That says elixir on that bottle. Great. Let's go all out. She has a super... 
<clears throat> I wonder if that's like monster cell ex extract. You know, like you extract the pure essence of it from the monster cells and it's just so like super concentrated of it because it's probably multiple cells. So it's like, I'm wondering if that's it. She's going to transform. Do you have any idea how long I've planned for this day? Okay. Noir! Okay, her power just ramped up quite a bit. Oh, she got the head veins. I don't like the head veins. Bear witness to my Super Saiyan hairstyle. Um, the one whom Guru Guru can't begin to compare with Lord Psychos and her terrifying psychokinesis. Okay, so the title is her name. I feel like I have heard that name before, so yeah. Disaster Level Dragon, Psychos. Okay. So she's not playing no more in that's the end of the chapter good chapter I, I did enjoy it um yeah I I don't really know what to say other than like the monster extract is probably what she was drinking like you know from the monster cells and stuff and maybe some other stuff thrown in there you know like some steroids and like things that are for like mental enhancement that are supposed to be like pseudo kind of stuff and like but it actually works in this world or something i don't know it would i mean there's a bunch of weird characters in the series that apparently have gotten abilities from the most random of things so something that's in our world is like a pseudo like yeah medicinal you know, like a medicine kind of stuff that's supposed to, like, help with, like, your mental focus and all that kind of stuff. Like, it would probably work in this world, to be honest. It's just, like, if you have the belief in it kind of deal, maybe. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. Just fun with Mikey in the minecart. Saitama stole some gold. <laughs> Lost it. You know, karma, I guess. Because even though he's stealing it from who he's stealing it from, it's still stealing, you know? <laughs> theft is theft, Saitama. I, you can't get rich that way, my friend. Um, but now that he knows it's down there, he might go back. I mean, he was like, if I'd known all of this was down here when he found out about the minecart. It's like, I would have had fun. It's like, so he definitely might venture down here in the future and, like, get some of it. Probably by then, like, most of it's gone or something. Or, like, another company, like, gets alerted to it and they find out and they mine it out. And he, like, gets, like, a small little bit of it. But enough to be like, eh, it's something. <laughs> and it's like, this will pay for a year's worth of groceries or something, you know. But, yeah, hmm. But yeah, Psychos is her name, so I will be calling her Psychos from now on. Um, weird how she had to go by a different name, so... Was that the name that she goes by when Fabuki is around her, that I'm wondering? Because, like, Tatsumaki knew about her, but she didn't say her name. So maybe Psychos is her true name, and she went by a couple different aliases depending on what she was doing in the moment. Probably the case. Hmm. But yeah, Psychos, eh, it's kind of an eh name, but whatever. It works. Uh, yeah. She just gave up on Rover. It's like, screw you, dog. <laughs> ooga booga booga. You know, like Eustace is like, screw this. I'm going to just drink the stuff. But it's like, she's had that whatever elixir for this long, yet hasn't used it before. Yet her power seems to have boosted tremendously so i would have thought instead of like having like the links and everything to like establish a connection with puppets in such a long range that she would just boost her powers with that which then either it's a one-time boost like the monster cells are if that's what it is i could be wrong or it's something that's going to have like a limited time effect on her which very possible especially given power-ups in general they don't always last <coughs> and i mean because i mean if she could just power up this way permanently all the time why wouldn't she have used it by now and just been like even more powerful and kept everything in line but you know whatever maybe it maybe it's a not something entirely different than what i'm realizing it to be 
But anyway, uh, but yeah, fun with Saitama and Flashy and Mike and, you know, Psychos now fully revealed as a dragon level threat, so girl got it going on. Strongest lady in the verse right now of villains, anyway. So, yeah. But anyway, uh, let me know your thoughts and opinions on the chapter. Anything I missed, misunderstood, or whatever, let me know down below. Um, and yeah, check out all my other content. Suggest things you want to see in the future. I'm part of a couple podcasts. The One Punch Podcast and the Weekly Manga Podcast. Those are on uh, Grim Reaper's channel for the One Punch. And I co-host the Weekly Manga Podcast with Griever. So go check out his channel as well. And uh, yeah, I stream on Twitch. I tweet it out when I go live. So follow all my social medias to stay in the loop. And uh, yeah, as always, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, Keishlings. That gold's gone.